The paper presents the development of an adaptive generalized network, AGNET, for ship-radiated noise recognition. It addresses the limitations of existing recognition systems by incorporating a learnable fine-grained wavelet transform. This transform converts fixed wavelet parameters into learnable parameters, enabling the network to adapt to the variable underwater environment. The AgNet uses a convolutional neural network with parallel convolution attention modules as the classifier, leveraging the implicit information in wavelet spectrograms. Experimental results demonstrate that AgNet outperforms baseline methods on several underwater acoustic datasets and shows robust performance against various interference factors. In the realm of underwater acoustics, the recognition of ship radiated noise in complex signal environments poses a significant challenge. This paper introduces an adaptive generalized neural network, AgNet, which aims to enhance the recognition of such noise in underwater acoustic signals. The proposed system is designed to solve issues related to poor generalization ability and the inability of classifiers to focus on valid time frequency domain information. AgNet's framework includes preprocessing, wavelet-based feature extraction, and a classifier with a parallel attention module. The network utilizes a fine-grained learnable wavelet transform for capturing complex underwater acoustic characteristics. This transform allows for adaptive updates of wavelet parameters in a data-driven manner, making it more suitable for practical applications. Additionally, the network incorporates parallel convolution attention blocks to focus on relevant information within spectrograms, improving the classifier's performance. Experiments conducted on three underwater ship radiated noise databases, Ships Here, Deep Ship, and data collected from Thousand Island Lake, demonstrate AgNet's satisfactory recognition accuracy, with scores of 85.48%, 77.09%, and 95.76%, respectively. The results also show that AgNet maintains excellent performance in low signal-to-noise ratio or low cutoff frequency conditions. Furthermore, the adaptive generalized network benefits more from transfer learning due to its more learnable parameters, enhancing its robustness against high background noise and low cutoff frequency. In terms of methodology, the paper provides an overview of the AgNet recognition system and highlights two main innovations, the learnable fine-grained wavelet transform and the parallel convolution attention module. The system's process is divided into three stages, data preprocessing, wavelet-based feature extraction, and attention-based classification. During training, both wavelet basis function and classifier parameters update synchronously, making AgNet an end-to-end -end system. The authors propose an adaptive ship radiated noise recognition framework, AgNet, which utilizes a learnable fine-grained wavelet transform to extract features from underwater acoustic signals. This modified wavelet transform allows for adjustable time or frequency resolution, converting wavelet parameters into learnable ones. This enables the wavelet basis at different center frequencies to learn differential parameters in a data-driven manner, achieving fine-grained wavelet transformation. The wavelet transform formula is given in equation 1, where the input signal is denoted as x, the point of the discrete sampling sequence is n, and the window function is w, dot operator. The wavelet basis function psi, n, is chosen according to the signal characteristics, and three widely applied wavelet basis functions in the underwater acoustic field are selected. Complex Morlet Wavelet, Seymour, Complex Shannon Wavelet, Sean, and Complex Frequency BSP Line Wavelet, FBSP. The wavelet basis functions are formulated as follows. Equation 2 describes the complex Morlet wavelet, equation 3 describes the complex Shannon wavelet, and equation 4 describes the complex frequency BSP line wavelet. The adjustable parameters of the wavelet function include the order parameter M, bandwidth parameter FB, and wavelet center frequency FC. Normally, M and FB are set firmly, but in the marine environment, signals are highly influenced by background noise, transmission channels, and other factors. To pursue better generalization ability, this work utilizes an end-to-end -end network to update wavelet parameters, realizing data-driven feature extraction. AgNet enables M, FB, and FC to participate in the gradient calculation and backpropagation, allowing the network to adaptively learn wavelet parameters for different center frequencies FC, 
as depicted in Figure 2. Adaptive Generalized Network, or AGNET, is a novel architecture designed to enhance ship-radiated noise recognition in underwater signal spectrograms. Built upon a ResNet backbone, AGNET incorporates an attention-based classifier to selectively focus on informative signal components. The classifier consists of a convolution layer, followed by a max pooling layer, four residual layers, an average pooling layer, and a fully connected layer. Each residual layer is paired with a parallel attention block, which enables the network to adaptively learn and emphasize critical features. The attention block comprises a max pooling operation, depthwise separable convolution, and batch normalization, reducing the number of parameters and computation time compared to conventional convolution layers. During training, AgNet takes raw audio sequences as input, which are then wavelet transformed to produce two dimensional wavelet spectrograms. These spectrograms are fed into the attention based classifier, and the loss between predicted values and ground truth is calculated. The incorporation of attention blocks enables adaptive learning, leading to improved recognition of ship-radiated noise in underwater signals. This innovative architecture enables AgNet to efficiently process complex audio signals, leveraging attention mechanisms to selectively highlight informative features and enhance recognition performance. Adaptive ship-radiated noise recognition is achieved through a learnable fine-grained wavelet transform, with a focus on experiment setup and results. The study utilizes three datasets, ShipsEar, DeepShip, and DTIL, which are unified and divided into training datasets. To ensure consistency, all datasets are downsampled to 16,000 Hz and cut into 30-second segments with a 15-second overlap, preventing overlap between training and test sets. A four-fold cross-validation approach is employed for ShipsEar and DeepShip to ensure credible results while DTIL data is split based on author-provided information. Test data is collected individually over a certain period. Framing operations are set with a 100 milliseconds frame length and 50 milliseconds frame shift. For baseline methods, 300 filter banks are used, and wavelet parameters follow Guzov et al. 2021, with m equals 0 and f underscore b equals 11. Learnable wavelet parameters are applied as initial values. During training, the atom optimizer is used with weight decay regularization, learning rate of 5E4, and weight decay of 1E6. All models are trained for 100 epochs on 4V100 GPS. The results demonstrate the feasibility of wavelet-based front ends with learnable fine-grained parameters, showing that attention blocks in the classifier module improve recognition accuracy. Transfer learning significantly benefits AgNet. The robustness of AgNet is evaluated, indicating it is less affected by colored noise and low cutoff frequency compared to other recognition systems. Recognition of ship-radiated noise is a challenging task, particularly in complex marine environments. To tackle this, researchers have explored the use of an adaptive learnable fine-grained wavelet transform. This approach involves evaluating various feature extraction frontends including time domain features, spectrograms, and wavelet transforms. In their experiments, the authors investigated different wavelet basis functions, ultimately finding that the complex frequency BSP line wavelet, FBSP, outperforms others. Notably, the learnable parameters of the wavelet transform were visualized, revealing an almost linear increase in the time center parameter with the increase in the time center parameter of the wavelet transform. The adaptive resolution of the wavelet transform is a key advantage, as it enables the recognition system to effectively capture the nuances of ship-radiated noise in complex marine environments. This is particularly significant, as traditional methods often struggle to accurately identify noise patterns in these environments. The results of this study demonstrate the potential of adaptive learnable wavelet transforms in ship-radiated noise recognition and highlight the importance of carefully selecting wavelet basis functions for optimal performance. The authors present a data analysis of the learnable fine-grained wavelet transform on three datasets, visualized in Figure 4. The figure illustrates the learnable parameters of the adaptive ship-radiated noise recognition model, with the horizontal axis representing the value of Fc and the vertical axis representing the values of M and Fb. Figure 5 visualizes the learning process of M and FB on the ShipSear dataset, 
showcasing the parameters after EPIC 1, EPIC 50, EPIC 75, and EPIC 100. The results demonstrate that the model converges around EPIC 7080, indicating that the AgNet gradually learns the optimal time frequency domain resolution assignment from the training data. An ablation experiment is conducted to evaluate the role of attention blocks in the model. Three features are selected for comparison based on the results in Table 2, including MEL filter banks with the best recognition accuracy among low-dimensional features. This experiment aims to investigate the performance of the parallel convolutional attention blocks on the three datasets. The learnable fine-grained wavelet transform is a crucial component of the adaptive ship radiated noise recognition model, as it enables the model to adapt to different noise patterns and improve recognition accuracy. The attention blocks play a vital role in this process, allowing the model to focus on relevant features and filter out irrelevant information. By incorporating these attention blocks, the model can effectively assign weights to different frequency subbands, leading to enhanced noise recognition capabilities. Adaptive ship radiated noise recognition is a challenging task in underwater acoustic signal processing. To address this, researchers have applied a learnable fine grained wavelet transform which enables the model to adapt to complex signal patterns. A key component of this approach is the attention module, which focuses on relevant spectral features to improve recognition performance. An ablation study confirms the attention module's effectiveness, demonstrating significant improvements in recognition accuracy when incorporated into the model. The authors also explore the benefits of transfer learning from the AudioSet dataset, a large-scale collection of audio samples. By leveraging this pre-trained knowledge, the model achieves notable enhancements in recognition accuracy on underwater acoustic tasks. This transfer learning approach enables the model to generalize better to new, unseen data, making it more effective in real-world applications. To assess the model's robustness, the authors test its performance against simulated interference, including low signal-to-noise ratio SNR, conditions. The results show that the model degrades relatively slowly under these challenging conditions, maintaining its recognition accuracy even when the signal is heavily corrupted by noise. This is attributed to the learnable wavelet transform and attention module, which work in tandem to extract salient features and suppress noise. Overall, the study highlights the importance of the learnable fine-grained wavelet transform and attention module in achieving high recognition accuracy in adaptive ship radiated noise recognition. The results have significant implications for the development of robust underwater acoustic signal processing systems. The authors present the results of their ship radiated noise recognition system, AgNet, on two datasets, Shipsear and DeepShip. The system's performance is evaluated using MEL filter banks, fixed wavelet, and learnable wavelet approaches. Figure 6 displays the confusion matrices for the best models, demonstrating the superior performance of the learnable wavelet approach. The diagonal elements of the matrices indicate correctly recognized samples, with the color depth representing the number of test samples recognized as the corresponding category. The system's robustness against low cutoff frequency is evaluated by applying frequency truncation to the shipsear and deep ship data. Figure 7, B, illustrates the results, showing that the wavelet-based AgNet is well-suited for handling low cutoff frequency scenarios. In contrast to low-dimensional features, the wavelet spectrogram-based features demonstrate a slower decline in accuracy until the cutoff frequency reaches 2000 Hz. This is attributed to the fact that time frequency based features are more resilient to information loss. The paper concludes by highlighting the key contributions of AgNet, including its end to end ship radiated noise recognition capability, fine grained wavelet transform, and CNN based classifier with parallel convolution attention blocks. The system achieves promising recognition accuracy on three datasets and demonstrates robustness against additive colored noise and low cutoff frequency. Future work directions include the exploration of adaptive learning on more complex data or tasks. The research discusses adaptive ship radiated noise recognition using a learnable fine-grained wavelet transform, emphasizing robustness tests on signal-to-noise ratio, SNR, and cutoff frequency. It showcases the model's performance in various scenarios and provides a comprehensive list of results.
The paper presents a novel adaptive ship radiated noise recognition method utilizing a learnable fine grained wavelet transform. It commences by discussing various denoising techniques for enhancing the signal to noise ratio in underwater acoustic communication, such as those proposed by Kalpana et al. 2014, and Wang et al. 2018. The authors also delve into research on time frequency analysis of underwater acoustic signals, including Wang and Zung's. 2014, Auditory Inspired Time Frequency Analysis, Wang et al.'s, 2013, Improved Harmonic Wavelet-Based Time Frequency Analysis, and Zhang et al.'s, 2016, Feature Extraction Using Mel Frequency Kepstrom Coefficients. Additionally, the paper emphasizes the significance of deep learning techniques in underwater target recognition, citing examples like Krish Heskey et al.'s, 2012, ImageNet classification with deep convolutional neural networks, Le Kun et al.'s, 2015, deep learning overview, and Shen et al.'s, 2020, ship type classification by convolutional neural networks with auditory-like mechanisms. Furthermore, the authors underscore the importance of feature fusion for underwater target recognition, referencing Zhang et al.'s, 2021, integrated neural networks based on feature fusion, and Zhang et al.'s, 2021 Time Frequency Feature Based Underwater Target Detection with Deep Neural Network in Shallow Sea. The paper also touches upon the use of neural networks for predicting marine propellers' underwater radiated noise, as demonstrated by Wang et al. 2021, in their work on NoiseNet. Moreover, it mentions the application of convolutional neural networks in underwater acoustic communications, as explored by Zhu et al. 2021 in their research on convolutional neural network-based filter bank multi-carrier system. Finally, the paper concludes with a discussion on the importance of optimization techniques in underwater acoustic signal processing, referencing K. et al.'s 2020 Integrated Optimization of Underwater Acoustic Ship Radiated Noise Recognition Based on Two-Dimensional Feature Fusion, and Sutin et al.'s 2010 Stevens Passive Acoustic System for Underwater Surveillance.